I want to get more comfortable with the octave mechanism. Uh, you could do this on any iwi, just do it the range of the iwi that you have, right? So if you have four octave keys, you can basically do it about four octaves. This is eight octave keys, so you can almost do it eight octaves. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to play fourths the whole way to the top of the instrument, and then I'll do perfect fifths descending uh, from the top back down. So it's always the same sequence of notes. It'll be C, F, B flat, E flat, A flat, C sharp, F sharp, B, E, A, D, G, C. The whole time it'll be that same sequence. So on the way up, you'll go the whole way to high, on this instrument, to high C sharp. So then when you get to C sharp, it'll be C sharp, F sharp, B, A, D, G, C, F, B flat, E flat, A flat. And it'll go the whole way down, it'll end on like a low C sharp, and then I'll just chromatically slide the C just to make it sound good. So here we go, uh, real slow once. It wasn't without glitches, so I'm going to put it at 100 and see if I can do quarter notes. So here's my metronome on 100. Cool, I'm just gonna do it at 110. If I mess them up, I'll just do them again. It's no big deal. Go to 120, we'll go up to 160. Here's 120. I lost my concentration, so I'm going to do it again. That's better. I'm going to go to 130. And instead of going to 160, I'm going to go to 80 and do eighth notes. And tomorrow I'm just going to plan on doing eighth notes and see how that goes. Here we go, eighth notes at 80, same exercise.
Yeah, that's enough of that for today. So tomorrow we'll do eighth notes. Cool.